you a general evaluator. It's my great honor to serve as deputy evaluator tonight. And uh, uh, actually, tonight I try another thing very hard. I try very hard to jot down the points that 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 um, might be a mistake. And I found that uh, Fulan just create you, you guys just create a very good atmosphere to share with your knowledge or share with your uh, language efficiency to everyone. So whenever someone forgets the, the words or don't know how to say that, and um, some of the members will support and give your answers timely. So I think this is a very good, uh, good uh, atmosphere and maybe a, a transition. And uh, okay, now, uh, following, I would like to share my points. Uh, 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 which I observed, but it doesn't mean that I'm right because I, I don't think my English is, is that good enough. So I just share my observation. If anything wrong, please uh, come to me and, and we can talk about. So uh, first of all, I heard, uh, I heard the speakers talk about uh, she was in Hungary, right? So it's hun Hungarian. So I, I think there was some, some special, um, no, not to say special, some country, they are different uh, when they pronounce, they are different from the, the, the people of the country. So Hungary, Hungarian. So uh, does anyone can tell me uh, if we talk about a person from Canada? Canada. Yes, okay, very good. And uh, um, someone say bros. Okay, in the first time I, I, I feel a little bit confused what is bros, and then I, th I think about, uh, it's a short of a brothers. Brothers, brothers, and uh, okay. Some pronunciation, maybe we can. Uh, when we pronounce the long words, the big words, try to pronounce every syllable clearly, so that will help us to pronounce it uh, to to eat to to be easy understood. So, for example, conception. Just try, uh, when you pronounce the long word, try not to be harsh, right? Not to uh, try to pronounce the syllable uh, carefully so that will make your pronunciation more uh, more uh, clear. Yeah. Oh, for example, expectation. Expectation. And when someone say, ask me, uh, if you are talking about, you, you, you want to talk to yourself or ask yourself, uh, maybe it's better to say, ask me, ask myself or talk to myself. And my question is very difficult. Uh, I, I, here I would like to emphasize the plural and the singular. Okay, when you say uh, plural questions are, uh, question is, so just pay attention for the minor, uh, for those minor uh, mistakes. Uh, we never, uh, someone say, I never talk to my, my sisters. Uh, I never talk to my sisters until now. Um, usually we say until now, that means I, I never do something until now, that means now I have done it. I, I actually do that just now. So if you, if you are describing you never talked to your sister or you never did it, uh, even by now. So you, you can say just say by now, not until now. Because when you say until, there were uh, many people think that actually you have done it just maybe just a few seconds before, or a few minutes before. And uh, um, okay, uh, someone say meet. I uh, she meet her dreams. Uh, Actually, he says she makes her dreams come true. I think when we say meet, meet it means fulfill, satisfied, satisfied. So uh, maybe we we'll just say she meet her dreams. That's okay. Or she makes her dreams come true. Okay, not combine two together. Yes, I think my uh, my time is is uh, getting closed. Uh, okay, one, one, one point. Uh, when someone say, my parents get old, 
I think uh, getting old is a process. We, 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 we cannot turn old just overnight. So it's better to say my parents are getting old or my parents are aged. Let's just say my parents get old. Yeah, that's all the notes I have uh, right now. Uh, but all in all, I envy every every one, every student's your uh, English ability. Actually, that they, they are <laughs> <laughs> they are much better than I expect. And uh, next time, if I promise to take this role, I will think twice. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, general graduate. Now it's my turn to general evasion. When I came to this venue, while wow, Joseph and your T and E Patricia came to me to do the greeting, very good job, and uh, I like that. In your meeting, the music, wow, so beautiful. That uh, is so lively. Uh, so that's why I like to attend your meeting. Especially the meeting thing. I just learned from a video in the YouTube, on the YouTube. Uh, it's talking about they do an invest, uh, investigation to the people who are dying and uh, ask them what's the most regretful things uh, you think. All the people say that they regret for the things they haven't done, not for the things they have did, they have done. Okay, so try everything what you can do, you can try. It's a very good thing. You have to try new things, otherwise you will, you will stick there. You cannot move on. And uh, I, I think that the meeting thing is very good and uh, very meaningful. In the meeting, the three helpers, I think you have done a great job because uh, in sometimes in our club, uh, the helper will use the script. Even if they use the script, cannot speak very well. But you have done a very good job because three of you have can uh, brief those your rules very clearly and very good. I, I think that's very good. And uh, in the variety session, Two times I won. I won two times. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I like that. <laughs> yeah, very, very good. Uh, for those three speakers, uh, one for C1, two for C3, I, I think you have done a great job, especially Mar Margit. Okay. Margit. 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 Uh, you have a very good content in your speech. I cannot believe it's a C1 speaker, especially you are a student in college. Uh, I, I think you live uh, your life. The uh, next one, put one skill in your uh, habit to, to, to try is speaking. Okay, every month try to speak, then you might be the champion. <laughs> yeah, in, in FJU, you have many, you have had many outstanding speakers. Even this time, uh, Stacy, right? Uh, she went to the district contest, and uh, you have uh, uh, Judy. Uh, Judy. Yeah, the this the district champion. Wow. So try hard. Okay. <laughs> okay. And the uh, table topic Sarah. The wonderful job because in that very short time you have six speakers to respond to your questions. Uh, like me, even uh, she brought bush a lot, but still try. Yeah, that's a good attitude. I I uh, encourage you to do more, try more, and uh, be brave on the stage. Don't be afraid of making mistakes, okay? Try hard. And uh, actually, I love uh, the two answers from Elder Sarah and me. I love doctors, but however, so sad I don't have it. Because <laughs> when you have one million dollars 
you will buy a house for your parents, okay? <laughs> well, your dream is uh, bring your parents to go travel abroad. Wow, my son won't think about that. <laughs> <laughs> Something uh, terrible only thing for them uh, in your table topic, okay? Confess yourself. <laughs> oh, just a wonderful job. And uh, for ID, um, you notice that Anne has done a very good job and she's a student. So I suggest you next time don't invite all the, the IDs from outside. Yeah, uh, like Joseph, like uh, some of your senior members, even you have done maybe C2, uh, C3, C4, you can try to evaluate the C1 speaker, okay? Try to do new things. Don't just speak there, okay? Now, uh, that's my general evasion. Uh, uh, present, Joseph. Thank you, Moses.